a never ending loop. So we want to know if you have any superstitions when it comes to buying your lottery ticket, kind of like a place you like to go or maybe anything else. Yeah, digital anchor Stephanie Haney has been talking with you on the website to get your responses. What are people saying? Do they have a place? Are they superstitious? Do they play the same numbers week in and week out? What do you, what'd you find? Well, we do certainly have our quirks. <laughs> we absolutely oh, do. You're being nice. Uh, listen, we got a, a particularly really good response that I'm excited to share with you. We're going to start with Mike Yoho. He says he, oh, this is a pretty common one. He plays the same ticket that lost previously and then another three tickets and he lets the computer pick the numbers for that one. But this is the one that really takes the ticket. Bill Roseman, here's what he does. He plays two weeks at a time, the minimum wager, so $2. Never plays at the same place twice in a row. <laughs> Loves to play outside of his own city, so if he wins, no one would suspect it was him. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> oh. Only checks his numbers at the two-week mark at the same time at 10.35 p.m. He says the Michael Stanley Band fans will get that one. I did some recon on this. That is a reference to the first line of Michael Stanley's song, In the Heartland. It's 10.35 uh. in the Heartland. Make your move or you never will. So that's when he wants to know he's won, wow. if he does. I love that, Bill. Oh, wow. Bravo, Bill. That's a now, lot of thought. In our three news in the afternoon Facebook group, Tammy also responded. She keeps it more simple. She always lets the computer yeah. pick the numbers. That's her superstition. Mine was kind of similar to Bill's when I was doing my Powerball experiment. I always tried to buy it at a different physical place. I didn't want to do it at the same store any particular time. I love that he goes outside his hometown. <laughs> I know. That's Sneaky awesome. Bill. It is. <laughs> Nobody gets it. Yeah, so funny. that is you, the last thing you want to do is let anybody know that you won. That's true. Right? Because yeah. your life will become chaos. That is true. Yep. That is the legal advice on the books is do not let people know that you have won if you do. Yeah. Unfortunately right. in Ohio you don't have to. That's right. Good. That's All right. True. We can so Bill, you can stay a secret. <laughs> Thank you, Steph. <laughs>